So here it is, guys. The 13 by 10 One Tigers tarp. Now you're thinking, oh my gosh, here you go with another One Tigers item. Yes, yes. Uh, I have been impressed with One Tigers and their products. So you will see quite a few more things uh, coming from them. I'm actually looking at getting one of their hot tents. Uh, so uh, when that happens, you'll see that one as well. But this is a 13 by 10. Um, the setup isn't the greatest, but like I said, I have just now broken out. Um, I've been wanting to get a rectangle tent for a while just to kind of see what they'd be like. And I got this one and I'm very pleased with it. Uh, let me t bring you in a little bit closer and I'll show you what I mean. So here's inside. Uh, I've done a slight modified, I'd call it a TP A-frame style thing going here. Uh, that side is a little bit loose. Let me get that around. That's a little bit loose, but that'll work. Uh, but uh, what I did this for was because I've got wind coming off of the lake and it, I needed to get something to block the wind. And so far this feels like it's gonna do, the same, do what it needs to. Um, also, it's going to change directions uh, sometime in the middle of the night. And uh, so therefore I wanted to make sure that hopefully I've narrowed down any chance of it getting in when it changes directions. Now my luck, it will not. But you just how it goes. So, uh, yep. So that's what this is. I'm probably going to lay long ways here. All that kind of good stuff. <laughs> but I'm pretty excited about uh, this tent um, and the possibilities that it's going to have for me when I get out. Um, it actually, excuse me, uh, packs down a little bit differently than the other tarp that I have. Um, and that's okay. It still packs down the same size when I do this it packs down at the same size um, the circumference of it's a little bit or diameter of it when it's, run, when it's rolled up is a little bit wider but not much um, which is cool so it's not taking up any more space in my bag and it really doesn't feel like it's too much heavier it's a little bit heavier but not much um, just because this is a little bit thicker of a material um, it's still got silk nylon silk nylon whatever you call it um, but it's 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 thicker, it's a little bit thicker on it. So um, I'm going to flip it around and I'll show you some other things like the stitching and the loops. So hold on. So the pros and cons to this. Um, pros, things that I like right off the bat on my initial, um, my initial impression is I like the tie-off points. There are many tie-off points that I can do things with makes it very nice and easy. I love the ridge line tie off points that I can tie up like that to a to a ridge line. Uh, makes life nice, right? So and then uh, and I'm still working on this so a lot of what I do will be um, trial and error until I get, get it down and find the one thing that I like the best, right? Um, any cons that I see right now is I'm still getting used to the rectangular aspect of this. Um, and then so that makes means that it's not really drawing tight the way I want it to certain things uh, Like the backside I would like to have had it to be a little bit more tighter um, And pulled out a little bit further, but um, without it actually opening up and that's That's probably user error. Um, I could have probably turned it around And allowed for that a little bit better, but um, that's just the way it goes um, And I'm really kind of running out of time for it. So there you go um, other than that, um, the stakes come in a nice, come in a nice pouch. Um, kind of heavy duty, actually. Um, and then there are tie-off cordage that comes with it. Um, and it looks like it's a reflective tie-off cordage with a different kind of tightening clasp that I don't have to get used to. <laughs> but... Uh, very nice. Also, I like the pack that the whole tarp packs into. Uh, one of the reasons I really like it is because on the back side of it, ha it has uh, webbing on it so that I can just tie it down to something on the pack or put it underneath, whatever. So, uh, but it rides inside my pack just nice too. So, there it is. The One Tigress 13 by 10 tarp. Um, it's a... Uh, rain fly tarp whatever they call it or not on the website but for my purposes it's a shelter tarp and uh, so far I'm really liking it and should be uh, nice all right thank you guys so much for joining 
Uh, remember, if you like these little videos of uh, my gear and, and all stuff, um, please feel free to subscribe to my channel. Uh, and there will be uh, some news and updates on, on certain things that are happening that are changing with my channel uh, here in the very near future. Thank you, guys. Talk to you later. Bye.